Please come today, May 14th, at 6 p.m. to the auditorium to support Honors Theater and to have a lot of laughs viewing their parody, Romeo and Juliet, COVID edition. The play runs half an hour long and there is no cost, but they will have a fundraiser where they will be selling items for $1. Attention all prospective South Lawrence cheerleaders. There will be a cheer interest meeting for parents and students on May 18th for the 2021-2022 school year. This meeting is not mandatory, but you are encouraged to attend. The meeting will begin at 5.30 p.m. and will be held in the South Lawrence gym. If you are interested in trying out, you must have a current physical uploaded to Planet HS prior to tryouts. Tryouts, tryouts will be held June 1st through the 3rd. There will be a JV squad, varsity squad, and a competition squad. In order to try out for the competition squad, you must be on JV or varsity. Please join the Cheerleading Interest Group Google Classroom for more information. The code is QWVRDYD. If you have any questions, please contact Coach Cooper. Attendance recovery is taking place Monday to Thursday from 7.30 to 8.30 and from 3.30 to 4.30 in the cafeteria. Virtual attendance recovery via Edgenuity is also underway. Spirit Week is scheduled for the week of May 24th. Please see the Bruin Blast for detailed information. Coach Slaughter and the Spirit Committee have several events planned for the week and we are looking forward to celebrating with our seniors and underclassmen. Attention seniors! Senior checkout day will be Thursday, June 3rd from 9 to 2. Chromebooks will be turned in and fee payments will be made in the Commons area. Graduation ceremony ticket distribution will be Thursday, June 3rd from 9 to 2. Be sure you have returned all material returns and paid any outstanding fees. Graduation rehearsals will be June 9th at 4.30 this is mandatory for all seniors participating in graduation ceremonies. The South Lawrence High School Baccalaureate service will be Sunday, June 6th at 2 p.m. in the South Lawrence High School Auditorium. Keep checking the Bruin Blast and BNN for information on Senior Week. This week will include homecoming, senior walks, a senior group photo, class night, and a powder puff football game. Seniors, be sure to meet appropriate attire expectations for the graduation ceremony and all graduation events. Quarter four interims are out in power school, so be sure to check them and share that information with your parents. Please make sure you have all grades updated in power school. Interims will be in the form of parents slash students checking the current average in power school. No printed copies will be distributed. Please contact Mrs. Bibler if you are in need of math tutoring. We have math honor society students who are willing to tutor and need the service hours. The National Honor Society induction is Tuesday, May 18th at 6 in the auditorium. Teachers, the faculty, staff, end of year luncheon will be held Thursday, June 10th at 1.30 in the cafeteria. Formal invitation to follow. Seniors, if you would like to be recognized during decision day on Friday, May 21st, bring in your acceptance letters to guidance or let them know if you've decided to enlist in the military. They would like to highlight your accomplishments and please see Mr. Dupree and guidance with any questions or concerns. Senior girls will have powder puff practice on May 13th, 17th, and 20th from 345 to 445. Attention all South Lawrence seniors. Each senior has been emailed a Google form from the yearbook staff to enter a baby picture and a recent picture of yourself for the slideshow. This will be presented during senior class night. The yearbook staff asks that all seniors fill out the Google form as soon as possible if you want your picture to appear in the slideshow. The Powder Puff football game will be held at South Lawrence on Wednesday, May 26th from 4.30 to 6.30. Admission is $3 and there will be food trucks on campus selling for all who attend. Come out and support your classmates as we will see which class will hold the winner's title for the year. There will be a mandatory rehearsal in the auditorium at 3.30 p.m. Monday, May 17th, for all candidates scheduled for induction into the National Honor Society. Please report immediately to the auditorium when the bell rings at 3.30 p.m. on that date. AP night will be held on May 18th in the chorus room. The Lion King will meet Friday until 6 p.m., that is today, 
Please make arrangements to stay after rehearsal to attend the Romeo and Juliet production made by the drum crew. Food will be provided by Ms. Taylor. ESC testing will take place the week of May 19th through May 28th. The next blood drive of the school year will be held Tuesday, May 18th. All students 16 years or older may donate. A parental permission form is required for those 16 years old, and forms are available in the front office. To sign up, please click the link on the South Florence High School homepage. Mu Alpha Theta is offering tutoring for the Algebra EOC. Please see Ms. Baum or email a Mu Alpha Theta member to arrange a time before or after school. Auditions for the South Florence Choral Leaders will be held after school on Thursday, May 20th. Stop by the chorus room to sign up for your audition and to pick up your audition and teacher recommendation forms. Are you interested in audio production? Do you want to learn how to record, mix, and produce music? If so, our new music technology course may be just the fit for you. With our new recording studio finishing construction soon, we are looking forward to hitting the ground running next school year. If you are interested in this program or have any questions, feel free to visit Mr. Terry in room 142 or contact him via email at eterry at fsd1.org. Good morning, South Florence. My name is Ethan Cooper. It's official. South Florence High School will have a dance team next year. Trials will be held on May 25th uh, in the dance classroom, 141, and will start at 3.45 p.m. and will be finished by 5 p.m. Please wear a school-appropriate, loose-fitting, and comfortable attire. If you are virtual and want to audition, please email Mrs. Tyler for information. Her email is ktyler at fsd1.org. Come and join the fun. Sophomore Powderpuff Girls will have practice Tuesday, May 18th from 3.45 to 4.45. They will meet in front of the school. See Ms. Diggs for more information. Join us Wednesday, May 26th at 4.30 in front of the school for our Powder Puff football game. We will have food trucks selling in the parking lot, so bring your lawn chairs and appetite. Come cheer on your classmates as they compete to see which class is the best. Admission is $3 for underclassmen and free for seniors. Good morning, South Florence. Last night, softball defeated West Florence 12 to 10 to end the regular season. They will start their playoff run Saturday at noon against Mid Valley at Mid Valley, and baseball will start their playoff run Saturday at 1 p.m. against May River at home. Thank you, and have a great day, South Florence.
myself, Lawrence. Today I'll be interviewing some of our administration who will unfortunately be leaving us this year. Here we have Ms. Nero, one of our assistant principals. Good morning, South Lawrence. Ms. Nero, how long have you been working here at South Lawrence? I've been working here at South Lawrence since 2017 when I started as an English teacher. I was promoted in 2018 to assistant principal. Do you know what position you'll be taking next year and where will you hold this position? Next year, I will be the principal of Virtus Academy. Ms. Nero, what is one of your favorite memories from your time at South Florence? One of my favorite and fondest memories at South Florence is having bus duty with Mr. Dukes and Mr. Coe in the afternoon. Uh, this was a time for us to engage with the students while sharing our accounts of the day, usually very crazy accounts. What is one thing you learned from your position at South Lawrence that you will take with you into your new job? I will take with me the importance of building authentic relationships with staff members. When authentic professional relationships are built, it is much more likely that effective teamwork will happen. Thank you, Ms. Nero. You will be greatly missed here at South Lawrence, but we wish you good luck at your new job. How did you discover an interest in art? Uh, basically just drawing in elementary school and just looking at pictures that basically inspired me, that's it. When did you start doing art? Um, like I said, elementary school with Miss Ryan at Greenwood. That's when I started mostly. Um, who is the best art teacher that you've ever had? Probably Ms. Hera. <laughs> What helps you make your best art? Um, basically looking at looking at references like on Pinterest and things and basically just getting inspiration from those and just basically thinking about crazy weird stuff. Um, where do you do most of your art? I do most of my art in my bed. <laughs> Why is art important to you? Um, it's important to me because basically I just like the creativity of it and I just like how you can express yourself through your art and like really basically just take whatever is in your mind and put it on the paper and that's about it. Alrighty, uh, thank you very much for the interview.